Hello, and welcome to today's roguelike ramble. We're back in Eldritch, because I like Eldritch a lot. Whoa! Where am I? What? I don't know what's going on. What are you? Uh, okay. I hit resurrect in the asylum last time. Anyway, <laughs> let's get going. I could start over, but now we're gonna leave that in. Uh, let's start from the first floor again. Oh, another compass! Did we get a compass when we started last time as well? Does it just give us a compass because we've completed this section once before, maybe? Maybe that's it. Or maybe I'm just very lucky because the compass is very helpful. Uh, I'm gonna get one of those and one of those. So, I play World of Warcraft, if you aren't aware, and the expansion comes out next week, and oh my god, I'm super excited. They've just released the Battle for Lordaeron uh, kind of scenario thing that leads into the expansion, and I played for it on both sides, and it was so good. Oh, it was so good. What is that horrible noise? I'm going to go towards it because I don't like living, apparently. Oh! It's not a horrible noise. It's a good noise. Good thing I checked. I have been rewarded for taking risks. See, dying to spikes is a thing of the past, because that is not an easy spike trap to die to. <laughs> so yeah, I'm fairly certain that when you do creatures it respawns them somewhere, but these guys are easy, so I'll leave them. But it's a kind of balance of do you want do you want loot or do you want like an easier dungeon kind of thing? Uh, let's throw that over there. Hope that opens up way below. Looks like it did. Don't need that. Oops. Okay. I really love the atmosphere in this game. Like, when I was playing this a couple years ago, I thought the atmosphere was kind of weird. But for some reason, playing it again now, it seems to like... Oh no. Seems to have a more positive effect on me. Okay, I should not have mopped the spikes. I understand that now. Damn it. Um, <laughs> how am I going to get around this? Can I... I don't want to risk just walking across them like that. The way they kind of pulse up and down makes me think. You can't. Oh, there we go. Oh. Oh, fuck. Now what? Shit. Um. Uh. Okay. Oh, bloody hell. Okay, I'm just going to go up here. I don't think this is where I came from. No, it's not. What is this? Whoa, is this a bonus level? Oh wow, okay, I've never come across this before. This is exciting. Okay, so the coins are facts, good to know, good to know. I'm gonna die to something horrible, aren't I? Holy symbol, a small stone tablet bearing a religious marking. It has no apparent utility. Okay. Wasn't this in one of the shops last episode? Like, if it has no utility, it has no apparent utility, that's the key, right? I guess I'd better abandon my compass and keep hold of this then. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Um, for now though, we should probably backtrack. Oh. Oh. Ow! Crap. Okay. Couldn't find that guy in time to stop that from happening. Aha! Now we're in business. Get killed. It's very 
quite satisfying to kill with a knife in this game. I was hoping there'd be something in there. I was rewarded. I just heard a door open. I do not like that. I'm gonna continue on this way. But yeah, World of Warcraft. Battle of Azeroth launches next week, so if we're a little bit light on content on this channel, it's probably for that reason. <laughs> I apologise in advance. It's going to consume my soul for a while. Um, I don't know if I'll do any kind of live streams or anything like that. Um, I haven't really live streamed in a while, thinking about it. I've just not been feeling it, really. Like, I'll get back to it, but... My mood is very changeable lately, so I'm better off just recording when I feel good, rather than like live streaming and then 20 minutes into it just being like, eh, I decided not to do this. I think I did that once for World of Warcraft actually. <laughs> I got like burnt out on it. But to be fair, I did then stream myself playing Destiny instead. Another one! Oh, I have so much health right now. That being said, I can't find the exit. I'm starting to miss my compass, that artifact better be worth it. Still don't know what those guys do. Okay. Down. <laughs> what is that? Is that because I've been on this floor for too long? I know some roguelikes like Spelunky have that. Oh shit, it's coming after me. Okay, I don't like this. What is this? Everyone is dead. Why is everyone dead? Where is the exit? Oh, there's another one. There's another one. I don't know what's happening right now. Where's the exit? Oh, no, God. Oh, God, that's horrible. Oh, God, no. Oh, my God. That actually freaked me out. <laughs> um, is it up here? Oh, yes, it is. Look. Okay, let's grab this. Get the hell out of here. <sighs> okay. Let's, uh... Add my current artifacts to the bank chest. That was horrible. Okay, so here's the thing. This is obviously the desert book, and then this is the ship book. That's the last level I remember playing. I don't remember unlocking anything else, but it looks like this is available to play. As is this one, whatever the hell it is. But for now, I'm just going to go with what seems like the chronological order. And that is this set of levels. I'll try not to die to weeping geckos this time. That's what I'm just going to call them, I think. Weeping geckos. Hi! Ow, yes, you can do that now. Good to know. Okay. I was like, wait, what do you guys even do? I killed you too fast last time to find out. And then he was like, this is what I do. Bam! Ew. <laughs> noise. Just looking to see if there's anyone I wanted to throw a bottle out while I had a bottle up there. Okay, now there is. I mean, I might as well conserve the ammo. What is that? Oh, it's dagger. Now he's hiding. hiding again. Okay. Okay. Give me my knife back. I'm gonna need that. There he is. I'm guessing these are meant to be curtains, but I've always kind of seen them as walls of meat. Makes this area a little bit more spooky. Uh, I actually don't have that long for work, so this might have to be uploaded tomorrow, but that's fine. Oh, there's a shop there, too late. I don't think I can jump up two blocks, can I? Can I? No. Oh, actually, I think I can climb. You know what? I'm just going to keep going. Just gonna keep going. So far I haven't seen any weeping angels. Oh. Weeping geckos, that's what I said I was gonna call them. Yeah, I think Ah
Okay. There's a lot of dynamite around. Oh, oh, I didn't know I could do that. We just set it off by hissing. Makes sense. Oh, God, I nearly ran into that. I think that's full damage if you go too far. Weird, there's not many items in this game, but it does feel really satisfying when you collect any one of them. Wonder how hard it would be to do an unarmed playthrough. I bet that's a thing. It's down here then. Yep, I've been here. Uh looks like oh, there's a way up over there, okay. Utilising my map. actually very threatening, they're just annoying. Oh fuck. Here we go. It begins. Okay. I don't think that uh, guy activated, so it should be good. Uh, down? Yeah, down. I'm annoying to actually disarm them though. I have to mouse over them correctly. <laughs> Fuck's sake, where's the exit? So many ways up though, I doubt this is the real exit then. Hey, here's the real exit then. I was wrong! Uh huh. It's weeping angel. Also, like betrayed. Okay then. Stop following me. Oh, right. Oh fuck. The way you attack them sometimes makes it sound like you're all right. Like, right. how's it going? See? Fucking hell. Um, is it possible to? I think you can blow them out of TNT or dynamite or whatever. But oh man, I have no idea where I'm going right now. Okay, I thought I would be safe because I was out of his line of sight, but nope. Nope. 